or preschooler can start reading before they even know all of the letters and letter sounds. After they've learned a few vowels and consonants, you can start blending words together. My name's Jess and I've been teaching preschool for 15 years now, and here's the best way to help your child learn how to read. We're only going to put the letters that we've learned here on our blending board, and we put vowels in the middle, and most letters can go on the beginning or end, but there are a few that work best only at the beginning when you're just starting to learn. So R, W, Y should always be at the beginning and not at the end because the vowels kind of change the sound to or R, um, and then X should always be at the end. When I first start teaching this, I will remind my students the sound of the letter. Remember, T says T, like tent. A says A, ah, like apple. And P says P, like pig. Let's put those sounds together. T, A, P, tap. Great. Now let's change the first sound and see what happens. Now we still have app, but we change the first sound to M, M, app. Map. Okay, let's see what happens when we change the middle sound, the vowel. Now we have an O. O says ah. So we have m, op, mop. You can keep going changing the beginning, middle, or ending sound. Um, it's easiest if you start with the beginning sound for beginning readers. Well, I do them all with my preschoolers by the end of the year. So if we continue changing that beginning sound, we still have op. Now it's s, op, sop. And it's okay if they're nonsense words. We're just learning how to blend the sounds together. B, op, bop. I have lots more to share on this method. Let me know if you'd like to see more.